Okay, so Chifuyu had a whole type of diff different personality, pretty much. He thought he was hot shit, but I'm pretty sure Banji put him in his place. All right, let's see how bad Banji kicks his ass. Wait, what the fuck? Why, hold the fuck up. That's Banji? Yo, yo, you gotta be joking. Nah, 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 nah. There's someone that's making him look like that, right? That can't be Banji right off the bat. What's up you guys, boy Perverse Senpai here, and we're back to another episode of Tokyo Revengers episode 22, I believe. And if you guys haven't noticed this, uh, I did buy a new mic because my previous mic, whenever I make loud noises or like laugh out of like nowhere, it wouldn't pick up the audio smoothly. I tested this mic and it works pretty well. But that's all I gotta talk about to you guys, and with that, let's hop on to the episode. All right, so we're back in the past when uh, the tall man were still brand new. Okay, is this like when? Okay, so this is probably like before they started making the tall man. I actually wonder how old you have to be to drive a motorcycle over in Japan. Oh, hey, it's Draken. <laughs> All right, so the whole gains in their motorcycle. <laughs> I seriously wonder if that's a, like if there was like really bikes design like that because that'd be pretty dope. <laughs> Mikey's all getting sleepy while they're all arguing. Uh, Pachi and it just scrolls by. Wow, Pachi really cheated like that. Well, that's a pretty funny intro for this new episode. I actually quite liked it. Damn, dude, Banji was last place. Hey, yo, this is actually the meetup that they have always in the future whenever they have a tall man uh, meetup oh okay oh he's been finding the black dragons all by himself oh so this is how they start their own game and then their reasoning is to help each other out in a way like don't fight your own battles you know what i mean okay so this is how they chose who was going to be the leader the vice leader and stuff like that oh wow this is pretty cool so banji was able to put where people were supposed to be in the grouping oh <laughs> that was the first name of the toe man that's pretty funny damn everyone's clowning on mikey's first name choice of the game now I can see why Banji really treasured the friendship that he had with everybody. Which even is more reason to be more sad about his death, honestly. I fuck with that. Oh, and then this is where they buy the charms. Oh. Yo, that's actually... Okay, that makes a lot more sense about the charm thing that Banji had. Taka. Traffic safety. Oh, so that's what the charm's called. That kind of makes sense if their like gain is all about riding motorcycles and being up people, right? You know, this kind of symbolizes that like without each other's help, they won't be able to do anything. So with all them together purchasing a charm, like it shows a symbolism of being a gain and helping each other out. And that's what Banji wanted as what the gain should symbolize and that kind of represents very well visually and verbally i think that's the right word oh so mikey held Banji responsible for holding the charm oh man here comes the sad music fuck me dude honestly i really like this sad piano note oh man it just makes it more sad for the charm symbolism right there <laughs> I really actually wonder if we're gonna get some more details from these other characters that look very unique. I really hope we do. It'll be very awesome. But that's mostly gonna happen like in the second season. If they continue doing uh, the anime for this series. Oh, is he going to jail? What, what does Kazutora mean by that? Like, is he gonna held responsible for what's gonna happen? What happened to that day? Whoa, fuck, okay. So now Kazutora finally fucking accepts his blame and takes the burden. Finally, yes! God damn. Okay, now I don't hate Kazutora as much now. You know, in a way, Takemichi is like, we're like seeing the view of all these powerful gang members. 
from Takamichi's perspective. Even though Takamichi is a protagonist, he's not the most powerful guy in the story, which I really like because you know me, I'm not the strongest guy but I do live my life as a protagonist. So I kind of have the same resemblance to Takamichi. He sees the story through and he tries his best to do what is necessary to change the future. Sadly, I don't know what my future is gonna be, so I can't change nothing of that. You know, I actually really wondered what's the meaning behind those white like Draken and the other guy has the white uh, rope tied around them. I actually gotta search that up at some point in the future. I'm actually very curious. Okay, so the Toe Man won the fight. So technically, it's still called the Bloody Halloween. But Mikey didn't pass the line of killing Kazutora. And Banji took his own life. So then it's not Kazutora's uh, fault. But Kazutora still took the blame of Banji's death and Mikey's death. So he actually accepted what he did was wrong. Dude, that moment was very sad for me. That's what it really made me want to cry right there. Oh fuck man. Tragic for something that they've been doing for a while it had to come to an end. Oh wait, this is Chief Fuyu? Yo, he had a whole different hairstyle, my guy. Okay, so Chief Fuyu had a whole type of diff different personality pretty much. He thought he was hot shit, but I'm pretty sure Banji put him in his place. Okay, so we're getting a bit of background story from this guy, which I really wanted to know very bad. All right, let's see how bad Banji kicks his ass. Wait, what the fuck? Why, hold the fuck up. That's Banji? Yo, yo, you gotta be joking. Nah, 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 nah. There's someone that's making him look like that, right? That can't be Banji right off the bat. Okay, so Banji's a nerd, I guess, during that time. Nah, they're all wrong. I bet Banji is just doing this so then he can just pass his class, but he's truly a badass. Oh, okay, he's a mommy's boy, okay. So he, he is a badass, so now he's trying to like pass his class. That's why he looks like a fucking nerd, okay. Okay, so this is how the, the, the slow friendship that Chufui and Banji made during the years okay uh, i wonder if chifuyu chifuyu is gonna see banji in action outside of school ah there's banji all right let's see banji in action take those glasses off and show who you are my guy oh <laughs> fuck dude okay so banji was already yeah he was already in the gang Oh, fucks. Okay, so that's how they did the reunion every time they go out and eat. Ah, yo, it all, it all comes to a full circle. Okay, man, I'm, I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a lot more tragic stories after this. I'm 100% sure. But fuck, they make it. They make it very understandable and emotional for this. Oh, 10 years that he's going to be in juvie? Damn, bro. Alright, you know what? Character development right there. He finally accepts what he did was something that he shouldn't have done. And now he even accepts more because what he's been doing the whole time wasn't right. Oh, fuck. Mikey forgave him. Oh, damn. Okay. This episode was really good. Like, no, there was no need of fights. Well, there was a couple fight scenes, but it was only to show us the storyline of uh, Fuji and Banji's friendship of how it was created and also showing that Kazutora is going to become a better man for the better future of his. And then Mikey was able to do what Banji wanted Mikey to do and to forgive Kazutora. Now that is awesome, bro. Before I end this video, I got a few announcements to make for this channel. First one is that I'm going to be releasing my AMV video that I've been working on three months. It's not going to be like amazing, God to. It just took me a long time to make the video. And you know what? I hope you guys do watch it and do like it because it did take me a while with the type of software that I have on this PC of mine. And I 
plan on dropping it within a few days because I finally caught up to the last few episodes that I had it to do some edits for. And my second announcement is that I'm gonna not be able to make the last two episodes of this uh, series because I'm gonna be upgrading my PC after I release the AMV. So you probably won't hear me besides me being on TikTok. So go follow me on TikTok if you wanna stay up to date for what's happening on this channel and the videos I make for TikTok, which I find it fun to do. But if you guys do enjoy this video, please drop a like. And if you guys got something interested in talking about this series or this episode specifically, comment down in the comment section. I'd like to see your guys' opinion about this episode. But without further ado, I'll see you guys on the next one.